Hi, my name is Chuck Cooley. I'm the founder of Feather Vision. And in this week's episode, we talk about whether you should use a spot lens or a 3D lens in your setup. You're watching On The Line. With your host, Chuck Cooley. We're trying to sort out whether we go with a spot lens or a 3D lens. And a lot of times there's pretty good crossover there. Now, when you're trying to decide what lens you want to buy, try to keep games similar. So, for instance, Redding, Field Archery, uh, Indoor Archery, those are all round circles, right? Target Archery, 50 meter game, round circles. So we keep the powers kind of similar and we keep the housing kind of similar. A smaller round housing so that we can center the lens and center the pin. We have a round dot that we're aiming at. Everything kind of is falling into place because it's a similar game even though it's a different field. Now in 3D we have animals at different distances and different sizes and we're trying to use the larger housing with less power to center everything up. So you want to keep that, uh, that kind of setup the same. If you're trying to keep the movement nice and calm, go with a bigger dot. A bigger dot will help you bring your field of focus out towards the red ring instead of just in tight towards the 10 ring. So bigger dot, that'll open up our focus a little bit it'll slow our float, especially in a smaller body. Same thing with the 3D. We go with a bigger body, but a smaller pin so that we can place it better. If we go with a small body, we'll hunt and peck all over the body of the 3D animal trying to aim. So try to match it up so that you have your housing and your lens power in your game all put together to keep the shot sequence nice and comfortable. I'd like to thank you once again for tuning in to this series on the line. If you have a question, please visit our website or call the office directly to place your orders. Feather Vision, the archery industry's lens authority. Are you seeing what the pros see?